Hey everyone, this is Lori, and I wanted to show you, for those of you who are interested in becoming a virtual assistant, uh, whether you want to work for yourself or start your own business, they're two completely different things. So even though you're still going to be a virtual assistant, if it's a business, um, you need to know how to market yourself. And one of the one of the best marketing tools for virtual assistants is video marketing and I'm going to show you some videos here so um, this is Upwork that's like a like a freelance website um, and there's freelance.com so there's a lot of video there's a lot of videos out here about freelancing but if you definitely if you're going to work for yourself you want to do video marketing without a doubt Okay, now most people aren't going to want to do that. So what I want to do is show you how to search for virtual assistant companies that hire you to work from home. Okay, so what I did was I just took, you know, top virtual assistant companies. Okay, and as you can see, here's a, a good site. Uh, evaluating the top virtual assistant companies for 2017 and when you're doing this you want to make sure that it's current um, as current as possible I have seen some articles listed back from 2015 and prior to that so some of that information might be outdated okay so you want to go with the most current and you can even type in 2017 next year for 2018 and so forth and so on you want to always use the year so you can get the most current information. But if you go out to this site, evaluating top virtual assistant companies of 2017, this is uh, Time Time Doctor, and as you can see, they have links for all of them. Okay, so these are all the ones that they're going to be evaluating and one one I don't see is virtual huh I'm surprised okay so all of these are virtual assistant companies that hire virtual assistants to work with various companies okay it takes you through it gives you um, a description of each site what experience you need okay so there's a lot of good information if I were gonna if I were gonna be a virtual assistant I would definitely use this site as one of my resources now you all you do have to apply for these but the cool thing about it is here's one that 24-7 virtual assistant, very transparent, entrepreneurial plan. Okay, it looks like you have to invest some money in that, so I would be kind of careful with that. Okay, so you can see there's a lot of companies. Okay, and I'm going to go back up to the actual list. I'll go back up here. Okay, so there's a list that they're referring to or that they're they're discussing. Another one, this is Virtual Workers of America. This is a Facebook group. It's a closed group, but you can join it. And they also have a lot of jobs listed out there as well. So, um, you can type in best, and you'll get some different articles. But these are just some of the, they're virtual. Um, these are just some of the searches that you can try to look for, and then um, do the research, and just, you know, research it thoroughly go out to Glassdoor and see what employees are actually saying about it and you could type in like you could type in virtual Glassdoor okay 
And let's let's try one. Uh, glass door virtual. Okay, and you can see, you know, the ratings aren't too bad. And then you can just check it out and see what people are saying about it. And um, just keep in mind that no company is going to get all positive reviews. Okay, there's going to be some disgruntled people that are going to go out and leave bad reviews. And it may have been something that they did that caused their, their own issues. Okay, so don't... Uh, you know, when you're reading through the reviews, keep an open mind that it's not always the company that is in the wrong. Sometimes employees are in the wrong, okay? So there's a lot of... There's, there's a lot of articles about it, okay? Because this is a very popular topic. So, and it's not just about showing you each one. I see a lot of people going through a list of of jobs or different types of jobs but I want to show you how to search for this stuff okay and and so you can be a little bit more independent about uh, what you're doing and you can learn how to research stuff better okay and there's all kinds of articles you can see this is a pretty that only gets 90 searches a month, but just virtual assistant itself, or virtual assistant companies, gets about 27,000 searches a month. So it's a pretty popular um, way to make money. And if you're good, you'll be in high demand. And you also want to look at, um, there was one article that I found about all the requirements. Maybe it was this one. But it had the requirements that you had to have for each one. Um, or not, not each one, but usually what kind of skills. We'll do a search for that. Okay, skills. Okay, so here's a good one. Qualities, you need to be a standout virtual assistant. So, um, reliability, that's huge, especially since you're not going to be working on site. Good communication skills. Time management. You're going to have a number of different projects that you're going to have to work on, so you need to make sure that you can manage your time um, so you can get the most important things done as quickly as possible. Um, resor resourcefulness, managing expectations and instilling confidence. And I'll let you read through this stuff. Um, but just do these searches and you'll come up, you know, come up with uh, all kinds of different stuff. Okay, so good communicator, resilient, thick skinned, dependable, reliable, consistent, versatile, flexible, adaptable, confident, resourceful, organized, um, understanding, empathetic, tolerant, patient, trustworthy, honest, professional, accessible, approachable, problem solver, self motivated, and proactive. Okay, so this is a good article that you might want to bookmark. So just do a search for, for the things that I did. And I'll put the search suggestions down in the description. So you can do your own searches and you can do your own research because this isn't about spoon feeding you. This is about you learning how to do your own research and come up with your own final decision about what you want to do. Okay. So thanks for watching. Good luck to you. And, um,
Please like, subscribe, and share if you know other people who are interested in becoming a virtual assistant or who want to learn how to do more thorough searches. Thanks.